Hey guys, in our today's video, we will be talking about one of India's mysterious temples, which is now a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Lepakshi is a quaint town located in Andhra Pradesh, India, nestled amidst a rural landscape. Guys, if you are planning to visit Lepakshi Temple, do watch this video till the end or you'll miss many important facts. Lepakshi holds a special place in the hearts of history enthusiasts, art lovers and pilgrims alike. The town is renowned for its historical significance, architectural wonders and the spiritual aura that permeates its surroundings. Lepakshi is perhaps best known for being home to the awe-inspiring Veerbhadra Temple, a masterpiece of architectural brilliance that dates back to the 16th century during Vijayanagara Empire's reign. This temple stands as a testament to the artistry and craftsmanship of its time with intricate carvings, stunning sculptures and unique architectural features that continue to captivate visitors. One of the most iconic features of Lepakshi is the monolithic Nandi statue, a colossal sculpture of Lord Shiva's sacred bull carved out of a single granite rock. This impressive sculpture welcomes the visitors to the temple and serves as a symbol of the town's cultural heritage. Beyond its architectural marvels, Lepakshi exudes a tranquil and spiritual ambience. The town's connection to Hindu mythology, particularly the legends associated with the Veerbhadra temple, adds to the spiritual significance of the place. Pilgrims and devotees frequent the temple to seek blessings and immerse themselves in the stories of divinity. The Veerbhadra temple in Lepakshi is a marvel of ancient Indian architecture. The temple is dedicated to Veerabhadra, who is the fierce form of Lord Shiva. The temple is associated with a fascinating mythological tale. According to the legend, during a yagya, which is a sacred fire ritual conducted by Agastya Muni, Lord Shiva and Parvati appeared as guests. Parvati was intrigued by the yagya, but her husband wasn't welcomed by her father Daksha. In a fit of anger and frustration, Shiva created Veerabhadra, a fierce warrior, from a strand of his hair. Veerabhadra then stormed Daksha's yagya, causing chaos and destruction. Eventually, Shiva restored Daksha's life and the yagya, but the temple is said to commemorate this event. Certainly, the Veerabhadra temple in Lepakshi is filled with fascinating and unbelievable facts that add to its mystic and allure. The first is the hanging pillar. The temple's hanging pillar is a prime example of an ancient Indian engineering prowess. It's believed that this pillar was deliberately left hanging during the construction challenging the laws of gravity. Visitors are often astonished by the fact that the solid stone pillar can be passed through from one side to the other. The uninterrupted shadow of statue of Lord Ganesha. In the main hall of the temple, there is a massive 3 meter high granite statue of Ganesha. The interesting fact is that no matter where you stand, the shadow of the massive statue doesn't fall on the ground due to the strategic position and angle of the statue. The eternal flame, which is believed to be continuously burning for over 500 years within the temple complex, among the intricate carvings and murals, there is an unfinished mural of Veerabhadra himself. The reason for its incomplete state remains a mystery, sparking curiosity and speculation about why the artisan stopped work on this particular carving. The temple's architecture is said to possess remarkable acoustic properties. Whispering at one end of the hall can be clearly heard at the other end due to the way sound waves are channeled. The ability to harness such acoustic principles during that time is astonishing. The carvings on the temple walls aren't limited to mythological scenes. You'll find a variety of motives and depictions including an intricately carved hanging lamp, a chain with 108 links that chime the bell. In front of the temple, there's a colossal granite monolithic Nagalinga, a representation of Lord Shiva with the seven-headed serpent providing shade. The serpent's 
heads remain undamaged even though they are exposed to the elements. The legend of the incomplete Kalyan Mandapa at the Veerbhadra temple revolves around two chief sculptors Veeranna and Virupanna. These brothers were entrusted with crafting the magnificent temple as they worked a misunderstanding arose regarding the proportions of the pillars they were sculpting. This discord escalated into a rivalry leading them to halt construction resulting in incomplete Kalyan Mandapa we see today. The town is known for a footprint believed to belong to goddess Sita, the wife of Lord Rama. The story behind this footprint and its authenticity are subjects to debate and intrigue. The massive monolithic Nandi sculpture and its precise positioning facing a shivalinga raise questions about the engineering techniques used by ancient builders. There are thousand other facts which arise a lot of questions about the mysteries behind this temple but then if you liked our video please hit the like button share your feedbacks in the comment section below and do share the video if you are new to our channel subscribe to the channel thank you for watching the video